Hello and welcome to Till Vacuum Do Us Part. Today I have an all day clean with me to share with you guys. So I hope you're needing some cleaning motivation. This is actually gonna be double motivation cause it's a collab with an awesome lady I'll be sharing here in a little bit. Um, but if you're new here, I would love for you to subscribe and join my channel. This video also has an awesome giveaway in it. So definitely stay tuned for that. But let's jump straight into today's video. Okay, so the first place we're gonna start is my bedroom. I had taken my mattress out because we were having a new one delivered. This is not sponsored, but I did pull that out and my headboard gets so dirty. Um, I have dark hair and I use dark dry shampoo, so I always have to clean it. So I'm gonna show you how I do that. I just use powdered Tide and water and this cleans so well. So I just put a teaspoon in of a powdered Tide and then add really hot water and you can clean so many things with this. I actually I actually learned about this tip over on Instagram and their page is called Go Clean Co. Definitely check them out if you're needing to be inspired. I love their account over there. Okay, so today's video is a collab with Emily from Mama From Scratch. Like, I seriously love this woman to pieces. I cannot say enough good things about her. If you guys are not watching her videos, you're totally missing out. She has amazing DIYs, she does decorating, she does home projects, and she does them all herself. Like, I have to call Chase in for backup, but she is like a boss at doing makeovers and home projects. So if you're needing to be inspired, definitely check her out. She is in the process of getting a new home and will be there soon. So she's going to have tons of new content. So definitely click on the link down below in my description box and go watch her video. Go subscribe and you can thank me later. <laughs> So I wanted to show you to clean my headboard. I'm just using an e-cloth rag. You guys know I love those. Emily's talking about them over on her channel today. She loves them too. And then just that hot water with Tide. You can clean so many things with this, but anything that um, you're worried about messing up, I feel like it's just super safe because it's like a laundry detergent. Um, also, I do use my e-cloths with them. And if you want to use a product with those and you're worried because you only are supposed to use water, it is detergent. So it's just like what you would be using to wash them in your washing machine so I feel like this is just a really safe way to use them and it cleans so many things the biggest thing I use it on is my white um, desk chair this actually looks pretty clean now because I do this often now but this chair used to get so dirty and the very top of it would be like black for my dry shampoo I really just got to learn to wash my hair more and quit putting that stuff in my hair it's running so much stuff but I've learned this tide cleans it out everywhere it messes up Jump, jump around and show them how I move. Uh, uh, oh, uh. Everybody will be on me. Wanna join me when I take a shot. I'll be the center of attention like I was some kind of astronaut. Cause I'm shooting for the moon tonight. And I got a feeling I'm gonna crash some stupid party. Tell the ceiling down. Okay, now I'm gonna head back into my bedroom so I can vacuum out in between my wood slats on my bed. I just wanted to finish using that product while the water was still warm, so I'm kind of jumping back and forth if you can tell. But I haven't taken my mattress off in forever. Like, I'm good about even flipping it, but I haven't like cleaned underneath it. You know, I clean underneath my bed, but not like where the wood slats are. So I'm gonna go ahead and vacuum up. There was a lot of like, I don't know, just dust and dirt in there. And Chase already has a hard time with breathing and allergies, so that's probably not helping much. So just vacuuming this up just makes me feel so much better. You can see my headboard looks a little crazy right now, but it's just because those are the spots that are wet that I had cleaned, but it'll dry. Um, you'll see it later on in the video, I think, and there's like no issues, it's just nice and clean. Right now. Oh, oh, oh. 
Now I'm gonna head outside because we had a windy night here in Oklahoma, which is not uncommon by any means, but when I open up all my blinds and windows, I just hate looking out to like messy pillows and stuff all over the yard. And it really only takes just a few moments to go out there and like fluff them up, adjust a few pieces out there, and then it's just something pretty to look at the rest of the day. So I do this a lot of the mornings, not every morning, but if it's windy, I definitely like to just go out there and get everything picked up. I'm gonna find your trust so I can put it on me Swing it from the chandeliers, I won't be sorry I got a feeling I'm gonna crash into this party Cause I'm just a I'm not gonna lie, moving the hardest part is leaving our backyard and our willow trees. I just love this area back here and just I don't know, it's just such a calming place. So I'm definitely gonna miss this more than anything else that's inside my house. So I'm just trying to soak it in as much as I can. I'm trying to keep it nice and clean. So every time I look out there, it's just like a happy place. Um, if you didn't know we were moving, definitely go back and watch Wednesday's video and you can get all the juicy details there of what in the heck is going on. It happened very unexpectedly. Um, but now I'm going to head to the front porch. Same story here. All the pillows fell, so I'm just going to work on them as well. Honestly, just taking a few moments and picking up a few pillows really makes a huge impact on your home, whether it's inside or outside, so just keep that in mind. Now I'm gonna head into my husband's office and do the same thing. Like, it's not dirty or messy by any means, but it is just not perfect. And so just taking a few moments and pushing in his desk chair, which has to be done perfectly or it doesn't fit. You can kind of see I struggle with it. And then just putting up a few pieces that were left out fluffing up the pillows, opening up the blinds, it really does just make the whole space feel like fresh and clean and perfect. Okay, so now I'm gonna head across the hall into my daughter's bedroom, but I just realized I never introduced myself. So if you're new here, my name is Ashley. Thank you for coming over from Emily's channel. Um, I'm married to my husband, Chase. We've been married 13 years. We met in seventh grade, so we've known each other a very, very long time. We have one daughter that we homeschool. She loves American Girl dolls. Um, I don't like color. I wear solid black almost every day. I'm not a good cook, but when I share recipes, they're super easy. And I love creating cleaning content, DIYs, home projects, decorating, all that fun stuff that involves around the home. And I love doing it on a budget. So if that sounds like fun to you, I would love for you to subscribe here and just join us. We just sold our house, so we'll be moving in a little and over a month. So we'll have lots of new content coming out. I have amazing women in this community. They are amazing down below in the comments. If you ever have a question, I'm happy to answer it. They're happy to help. It's just a really cool, positive community here that we're creating. So we would love for you to be a part of it. So when our delivery showed up, I was not expecting a huge semi truck. So it was just so funny. Savannah loved watching it. I'm sure all the other kids in the neighborhood did as well. It's just funny how like any change is so fun to watch. Um, so like I said, we're having a mattress delivered. This isn't sponsored, but I am going to share my reviews on it here in a second because I asked over on Instagram for suggestions and almost everybody was like, I don't know, but if you find one, let me know what you get. So I'm going to be talking about it here in a second and I have a giveaway. 
away, hint, hint, wink, wink, so definitely stay tuned. But while I let the guys handle that mattress, um, I also had somebody else comment that has a golden doodle like George, and she was like, does George have any issues drinking water, or does he do it really well? No. I'm going to show you some clips, and they don't even do it justice, especially right here on this white tile. I swear it's like a puddle. I could, like, jump and splash in it. He, like, doesn't swallow. He just, like, puts it in, and then that last couple drinks, he just lets dribble out his mouth as he walks down the hallway. So you can, like, see exactly where he is. So this is what I do. I just take my e-cloth pet towel, and I just wipe it up every day, all day long. <laughs> After I cleaned up the floors, I noticed our sink was starting to fill up with dirty dishes. I will say since Chase is home, that's one of like the hardest areas. You can see me examining it here. I'm like, is it dirty? Is it clean? When I was just at home, I knew if I had ran the dishwasher, I knew if it was clean, I knew if it was dirty. Now I'm always guessing like, did Chase run it? Um, is it clean? Is it not clean? I'm always like checking it. Same with like feeding George. Like when he was at work all day, I knew if I fed him, I knew if I didn't. But now I don't want to overfeed George. He already is like super happy and fluffy. So it's funny just like once you have your spouse at home, like the different things that change you think would be easier, but it also just kind of gets into your normal routine and you don't know what you're doing. So I said all that, you know, just while I was working on the dishes. Now I'm going to go ahead and hand wash. Um, this is like our grilling tool and it has a wood on it. So I don't like sticking it in the washer. I um, mean, it's from Traeger. It's really nice. So I just always hand wash this and then hand dry it and put it away. Play. onto laundry and I feel like I found a really good system right now. So when our house was up on the market, I didn't want to have laundry baskets everywhere. So I got rid of them and I just said, anytime you have dirty laundry, throw it in the washer and I would just run it once a day. And it made life super easy and simple. Not that I'll do that forever. Um, you know, we'll eventually have laundry baskets again, but I just thought it was so nice and so convenient. Things were always ready when they needed them because you wore it one day and then it was clean the next. I don't know. If you're looking to find a new routine with your laundry and you don't have like a thousand people in your family, definitely try that out. But now we're going to move on to this bed. So like I mentioned, I had asked over on Instagram, I need a new mattress. Does anybody have a mattress they love that doesn't cost as much as a used vehicle? <laughs> and it's really hard to find. And I actually had a sweet viewer that worked for Dr. Oz's new mattress line. And so she offered to send me one, but even more importantly, she offered to do a giveaway to one of you guys. They're gonna host it, or we're gonna host it over on Instagram. So you're gonna have to go follow my page over there. And I'm gonna have the link down below in my description box. It's just easier to communicate with you guys and to get addresses and stuff to know how to ship it. But I'm not gonna lie, I am loving this mattress. So we've slept on it three nights so far. I know the biggest question is gonna be on the firmness. Is it firm, is it soft? Just so you know, I'm a soft person. I wanna cloud, I wanna soak into it. This is a little bit firmer, but it doesn't matter because you don't really notice it because you're, so this is like the adjustable height. So we can like move up our head, we can move up our feet. So we're never sleeping flat now. So you don't sink into it like you think, like you make the mattress move to shape your body. It is amazing. Chase has nose issues every single night. We thought it was George and it was the bed. Like now that he's setting up, he's had zero issues. He's not snoring anymore. So I'm sleeping better just because of that. 
We are so happy with this mattress. So I want to thank um, Oz the Good Life Mattress for sending this and, you know, also doing the giveaway. Um, I am just so happy with it. I also wanted to let you guys know when you order a mattress through them, I'm going to leave the link down below in the description box if you guys want to check out their website, but they offer a free white glove service. So they come in and set it up for you. So there's no like stressing, worrying about it. They'll haul off your old mattress. So if it's like dirty and you don't want a truck and you don't want to pay to take it to the dump, whatever the situation is, they will take care of that for you, which I think is super, super amazing and so needed. We are a family that doesn't own a truck. Now we are keeping our other bed just since we are moving. I'm gonna throw it into our guest bedroom because it's still good for that. Um, but if you did need to get rid of your mattress, I think it's awesome they take care of that for you. Um, this bed was super cool. It has like massagers built in. It has phone chargers. I don't know, it feels like a cool little spaceship and we are sleeping so much better and that's all that matters. <laughs> I promise all this bedding is clean. I washed it and threw it in here, but I didn't want it out in our bedroom so we wouldn't be messing with it while trying to set up the mattress. I did want to mention you guys saw me like open up the mattress. So the company was supposed to come this day to put it up, but um, one of the deliverers that was going to be installing it had a family emergency and they were going to come the next day. But you guys know with me with like moving and filming and editing, I just didn't have time to wait. So we went ahead and installed it ourselves and did just fine. So obviously it's a free service, take it. But if for some reason you don't want people in your home right now, just with COVID and all that, you can do it yourself. But I just wanted to let you guys know because I did show us installing that, but that was why. Um, as you can see, Chase is just helping me put all the bedding back on. This is what it looks like done. It's beautiful. You would have no idea. It's just adjustable like it looks perfect right there you can see george is destroying that stuffed animal don't worry he was just fine you'll see me take it away from him here in a second Now I'm gonna head back into my laundry room and hang up my vacuum and then I'm gonna go ahead and switch the laundry while I'm in there. So like I said, I've just been doing one load a day. Um, so I wash it in the morning, I normally flip it in the afternoon and then I fold it at night. I just feel like that's a super easy, attainable goal to achieve. <laughs> Laundry's so hard and we're a family of three. And I know a lot of you have way more family members than us. So definitely just try the system out and see if it helps you out at all. The next space I'm gonna work on is my beauty room. It's just kind of gotten out of control. We have dresses all over the place in here. Um, we have a lot of weddings coming up this month and next month, but they're all like, you know, weeks apart and Savannah's in them. So we have like rehearsal dinner dresses for both of us. We both have dresses for the wedding. That's her flowered girl dress hanging up. It is so stinking cute. The back's even cuter, um, but it is kind of wrinkly from being delivered. And so I like to just hang it up in my bathroom. And then when I take hot showers, it helps get those wrinkles out. If not, I own a steamer, but typically that's enough. Like I have enough time to take enough showers in there. So that'll be good to go. And just now that I kind of put everything back in its home, I'm gonna vacuum and this room will be done. I don't wanna save ya, don't wanna be strangers. Let me feel like you know what to do. Leave your limitations, live and go against them. Just let go and start up something new.
Cause I know, I know, I know that what you planned out Everything that you built up isn't what you want And I know, I know, I know the life you're living isn't that fulfilling Okay guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here. I'm just exhausted today. We've been super busy off camera, but I wanted to let you guys know that my next video will be up on Wednesday and it's gonna be my fall evening routine. I'm gonna share cooking dinner, um, my cleaning routine for the evening, what we do as a family, and even my skincare routine at the end of the day. You guys are always wanting to know what that looks like. So that will all be in Wednesday's video. So definitely make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss it. And don't forget to head on over to Emily's channel, Mama From Scratch. She is incredible. I know I talked about her before already, but she's amazing. You will love her. So definitely click on that link down below and head over there. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.